peace be the journey. I'm here today in my backyard and I've decided that we need a toilet, an outside toilet for the land. Um, all them pallets I've been saving for the horse box if you've been watching the last videos I'm going to use for my toilet and then get some more so um, this is the first side I've done. All out of recycled pallets and an old cupboard door. Um, I've just chopped them up and uh, stained them, sanded them down and then I'm in the process of doing side two is here, I'll set it all up. Basically these are old pallets which I've just put up in, made a frame for it and then this part in the middle here is going to be a stained glass bottle window which I make out of cob but I'm not doing that until uh, we get it in situ. So I'm going to screw all these together and then stain it to make it look like the one over there and then See how we're going? See how Pink's doing over there? That's it for now. I'll finish these uh, screwing and then I'll, uh, I'll show you what I've done next. All right. Right, that's it all screwed together. I'm just going to sand it down and then varnish it. Um, might be a bit boring, but I'll speed it up. All right, see you in a minute. From the neighbour, the neighbours gave me that. And just finished off the back, give it a coat of varnish. So that's all four sides done. So I started putting them together. The only thing I'm waiting for is the roof. Day four, probably, on this uh, toilet I'm making, or outhouse if you like. I've put all the sides together, ready to build the floorings. So I know where the floorings are going. I've done it in sections so we can move it. Um, so obviously you saw each section, there's two sides back and front, and the one with the door on. And it's built on a pallet. So uh, I can take it all to pieces and uh, build it back up when we're there. So here's the front of it. Obviously it needs needs varnishing. Um, that's not a door, it's just a bit of wood we use for the bike. And uh, this is where the glass bottle uh, wall's gonna go when we get in situ. So you can see there's a pallet on the floor which it's sat on. I fastened it in place so I can build the floor in place and it'll all come off and the floor will still be there with the toilet block. So then, uh, when we get down there, we can just build it up 
um, and it's all saw slot into place like a, a uh, flat pack. But I made a little bit of a mistake on the door. I've used yacht varnish, but I think, well, I know it wasn't clear varnish and it's gone a bit funny. I, I quite like it, but I don't think my uh, good wife will like it. And I've missed a bit off the top there, which I can put the gutter on, but I made a bit of a boo boo there. My measuring scores are not up to scratch, but I'll take you around it. I had to use my Land Rover to prop it up when I did it. But, uh, I think the finish is quite nice. It's, uh, just all pallets, all old wood. That's an old wardrobe door, an old window from next door. I've not had it opening because it's just, just for rigidity. And uh, I'm still trying to find a roof for it. So I'm trying to get it for free, you see. And there's, there's bits of roofing I can buy, but I, uh, I want it free, <laughs> if I can, anyway. Um, and then uh, it'll be totally free, apart from screws. Anything I bought with screws, I might have to buy a toilet seat, possibly. Unless I can get a new one that someone's chucking out, but and maybe buckets for the compost. But bear with me; I'll show you the rest of it as I'm going along. It's a bit hard to film as I'm doing it because there's like loads of me just screwing holes in and screwing it together. I'll try and show you the, the little bits together. Um, but if I do it in stages, you can see I'll do a little bit of what I've done and then go for it. Um, but it'll be floor and. Uh, toilet seat base today and um, maybe want more varnish and cleaning that varnish off if the life doesn't like it so keep watching Ooh, it's hot right so far I've been putting it all together as you've seen before it's all taking shape now the door uh, went very wrong well, I hated it then we decided to sand the old the varnish off and change it and she hated it <clears throat> then I painted it green and she hated it so we tried to rub the green off and I think it kind of works happy accident if you like <clears throat> so just a little finishing touch isn't it keep the door shut when you're in it and then I've made a little box where the buckets are going to be some old pans and I'm just going to put the sawdust in there and uh, use it like that and uh, obviously got a little lock on here so now I'm sat down in my loo Thank you.